Okay, so welcome to a new video. Now today I have got a very quick video, but hopefully a very exciting video. And I am aware that I am one day late with my typical upload schedule of Wednesday. So hopefully the content of this video will make up for how late this video's release has been. So just a couple of things that I'm working on here. And to address the first problem, which is getting overwhelmed with too much information on YouTube, because typically watching videos on YouTube, you don't really have any structure to it, especially on my channel. So things can get a little bit confusing and a little bit overwhelming for some people that just don't really know what direction to take or what to do next. So I wanted to use this video today to announce the creation of my new website, which is going to structure everything that I talk about on my channel all my KDP perspectives into one place and include things that I really don't talk about on my channel much. And I'm going to show you this in just a second. So the second project that I'd like to work on is a new case study. So I'll talk about the niche of that in just a second, but I wanted to give you first a sneak preview of my website. So at the moment, it's nowhere near being finished and I'm gonna be working on this pretty hard. So that is absolutely packed full of goodies for you. So depending on when you watch this video, the site may or may not be active. If you're watching the video within the first few days of me releasing it, then it probably won't be. So if you want to get updated, with when I open access to my website and when I update it with new content, then you have to join my Facebook group to get alerted to that, okay? Which is where I'm gonna be announcing the updates and you know things like that, okay? So if you wanna go ahead to the description of this video and join my Facebook group, you're gonna be the first to get notified as to when the website goes live and when new content is added to it because it's gonna be a lot of content. It's gonna be a lot of stuff that people don't talk about in YouTube videos and uh, yeah, it's exciting. All right, so let's just come over to the website now and take a look at the framework. And like I say, this is nowhere near being completed, but I just want to give you a preview of what I'm sort of going for when it comes to the layout and the type of content that's going to be included. So again, if you have any suggestions within reason, please make sure that you leave them in the comments. I'm going to be reading them, I'm going to be taking note of everything that everyone has to say. So um, yeah, just to give you an idea as to what I was and what I was sort of going for here is to include your typical kind of blog posts. Now, these are going to be things that I don't, make videos on because I don't know how to make videos long enough um, around these type of topics. So for example, the first one that I'm going to be doing is does having a bad ACOS matter? And what I'll be doing with these type of posts is actually going into my own account and hopefully get rid of that disgusting green animation. But um, yeah, going into my own account, taking a look at things like the ACOS and you know, explaining why things like this don't actually matter that much if you're doing things in a certain way and you don't need to panic. Um, if your ACOS is going a bit crazy. So I'll be explaining those type of things on blog posts as opposed to in YouTube videos. Because what I find is once I start talking about something, I don't stop. So I think if I can write things out, then you know, you have a much more structured and um, easy way to sort of understand what I'm trying to get out here. And the same thing goes for the posts that I make inside my Facebook group, like this one here that I wrote last week. Um, I, I go crazy with things that I, I write and they tend to just, I tend to go on and on and on and on. And I think information like this, this is, in my opinion, really good information that I've learned over the you know the last few years that I think deserves to be recorded somewhere so that it doesn't just get lost in a, in a Facebook group. Okay, so stuff like that, that's gonna be uploaded onto the blog as well so that people can always refer back to it when they're feeling a little bit lost or a little bit confused about certain things, okay? So alongside those typical blog type posts, I'm gonna have the main sections that you can see up the top here. Now these are gonna be really exciting um, and you can refer back to these at any point whatsoever if it gives you motivation. So for example, you, if you watch my channel, you know that I review and use quite a lot of software on my channel. So I'm gonna have dedicated sections here that are, um, that are gonna be written reviews so you can quickly see the pros and cons of any software that I use so that you can see any bonuses that I offer, how to contact me regarding the bonuses and things like that. Okay, so just to make these long videos that I make much easier for you to you know come back and get sort of snippets from, okay? So from there, we're gonna be taking a look at sections dedicated to courses that I might release in future. And um, there's nothing in there at the moment. Then I'm gonna have this section, which I want to make kind of one of the biggest sections, which is gonna be KDP for beginners. So. What I want to happen is for people to refer back to this website basically when they're feeling a bit lost. And what I'm gonna be doing is basically having my entire structure, my entire approach to KDP sort of mapped out in here, okay? So that beginners can follow it um, and sort of have that clear 
perspective going forward okay because i do have videos on this but they're literally like two hours long and i know people don't want to sit through two hours of me umming and ahhing all the time so again you'll be able to refer back to this and sort of see it in a more structured bullet point type way okay and again i'll be updating this as and when okay so rants is a section that i don't know why i've just included this because that could be funny to put in but i i, I don't know what i'll do with that um income reports is one that i don't talk about on my channel i think if you watch my channel you know that i don't necessarily see the purpose but i do understand that they are quite motivating for some people to see um income reports so i might include for certain books income reports on how um on how they're going so from there we have the case studies again these are books i've actually uploaded onto amazon and you could these are going to be clickable so you can go and see how they're performing and track them uh, again this is really just basic stuff here i'm going to be including much more details about each of these books when it comes to releasing the um the the website so yeah that's basically the website as it is at the moment that's the structure that i'm sort of going for i might include a section that's dedicated to my other pursuits as well so you now the other main one that i i'm looking to build this year is my fba business so again if there's enough interest then i'll probably include it but there's only so much that i think you can talk about when it comes to fba but you know it, it still might be interesting for some people so just regarding the case studies here that's going to move on to the sort of second project that i'm that i'm working on so at the moment i am creating a, a maze book for kids ages four to eight i'm sort of halfway through it not sure when i'm going to release it because i don't really like rushing books um but what i was thinking of doing since that's under like a completely separate pen name is to use that as the next case study that i do because i was looking through maze books for kids sort of four to eight type of age group and they sell extremely well like granted this is like you know the first page but there, there's certainly a demand for it and it's an area that i wanted to sort of get back into and make a really damn good book around and i think this would be a really good one to make a case study out of so again if you're interested in that make sure that you leave a comment below because i would love to do a case study for everyone um regarding these type of books and i think that the more case studies that i'm able to release like the more that people watch uh, you know you'll get a very consistent you get an idea of how how my approach is and how consistent that is across the books that i'm releasing so i think the more case studies that i can do and show off the better that people um, the, the more people will be able to benefit from that so again let me know in the comments if this is something that you want to see and that's going to be pretty much it for this video i know it's a short video but hopefully this is quite exciting for you again make sure you join the facebook group if you want to get alerted as to when this goes live and when updates happen because you know there are going to be points where i make significant updates to this and you're going to want to know um, because they're going to be they're going to be awesome anyway that's it for this video i'll see you hopefully next wednesday it could be thursday but um i'll see you then